Hello everybody, and welcome back to the 8th episode of Tremor Remastered. Today, we're back in the glacier biome with our boys, and having the feud of the Alchemester last time. Today, we're going to be planning on doing the Twins and the Destroyer, which seemed pretty easy. But then we're going to take on a very infamous boss from Tremor known as the Motherboard, aka Mechanical Brain of Cthulhu. Which, you know, I've heard some very mixed things about it, and a lot of them bad mixed. So we'll see how that goes. But first, we're going to also go get some more upgrades for some weapons. Um, last time I also saw, I have the um, Colossal Sword, and I saw the Earthbender was an upgrade to that. So I might make that, depending on um, how much of the uh, Earth Fragments we got. We should have eight. Honestly, that's really good. And while we don't have that many Souls of Night and Light, we still have enough to, um, it will be, it's easy enough to get those. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Hmm. We're going to have to find a good area to go farm out for these things. Because this could take a little bit. But if this works out, it'll be a really good weapon. Well, that was quite unfortunate. Apparently, it's like, oh, yeah, uh, enemies underground and underground jungle. Well, I think our best way is to go to the underground jungle and go farm for those. So, yeah. Yeah, there we go. We got a somewhat effective. Oh, that's that's gross. Hey, those guys drop earth fragments. That makes my job a lot easier. Also, um, I don't like how dark it is. So, Bwah! there we go. Only three. Okay. Oh. Thorn balls. Thorn balls. Interesting. There's a dragon on it. Hey, last earth frag. Let's go. Now we can go farm out for, um, for souls of night and light and get our weapon. There we go. I think that's enough. Yep. Let's go back home. Now I can go farm in the crimson. Hey, final soul of night. Let's go. Boom. Back at home, baby. Oh, maybe I have to make that at the Altar of Enchantment? No, I just have to make it at a regular anvil. Oh, right, it's the Colossal Sword we're missing. That makes sense. And boom, there it is. The Earthbender. Now, please, don't be a true melee. It's a true melee. I am severely disappointed. All right, new weapon. What are we going to make? What are we going to make, boys? Well, lesson learned. Don't spend stuff on weapons like swords. Because apparently, a good amount of time, they're just not going to be good. I still don't know how to get Opal. If I knew that, it would be a lot easier. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, my God. I'm so dumb. It's literally just a combination of every other element or thingy. We could try the brilliant behemoth, honestly. Oh, but we have to go farm in the crimson more. Yeah. Hey, there we go. I, don't, I still don't know why those guys drop chain knives. Weird. Oh, thank goodness. Now for the easy soul farming. Light. Uh. Alright, I do think we're safe tonight, though, from um, certain... Um, hey, there we go. Nice. Okay, let's go back. Alright, time to go to the jeweler to buy one of each jewel. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Or three of each jewel. Okay. Um, you can go in there, and so can you guys. All right. Can okay, we can just make it here. One, two, three. Opal, the king of all gems. All right. Now I have to buy twenty-five freaking amethyst. I know we don't have any amethyst because we spent it all on the um, uh, the uh, uh purple piece for the uh alchemester fight last episode. Go, and I'm assuming we make this at a, a great anvil. Oh, interesting. Um, I think I believe we have the thing at the base, so let's go. Yeah, here we are. I believe there it is. Brilliant behemoth. I mean, it's interesting. I don't know if it's gonna do as good. Oh, it might do some nice damage, I guess. We should do one more weapon though, because I do think we are pushing it a bit. 
Unless there's a thrower X. No, there's no thrower accessory I can tell. That will help us. All right. Yeah, it's looking like we don't have too many interesting things to get right now. Okay, sure. There's some stuff like Souls of Night stuff that are interesting, but Souls of Night, it, it gets kind of a... Uh, let's see. Erupts three firebolts. Oh, this thing creates the moonlash, right? All right. We'll farm out one more item, a.k.a. the uh, Scourge of Flames. And then we'll see how that goes. Oh, it's a devil tortoise. Ooh, I like that. And, oh, I don't like that. Um, Yeah, <laughs> whoever sprited it forgot about that. Uh, oh, geez, I don't want to deal with that guy. There we go. I think we have everything we need. Let's see. Um, 10, 7, 8. Yeah, let's go back. There we are, the Scourge of Flames. Oh, look who it's like. Very useful, very, very useful. Now, um, geez, we have a lot of weapons. Wow, we've almost completely replaced our weapons with uh, hard mode variants. Nice. Sorry, Stormblade. I shall see you one day. Anyways, I think that's pretty good. We're off for now. Uh, not for the video, but, uh, for our upgrades. We should also probably go get some more wings now. So let's go farm out for those. Yeah, no, this is just like the um, uh, Phoenix gun. But instead of a... Instead of a range, it's magic. And I, I you know what? I'll like this. I'll use it. It's basically the same thing, but why not? Huh? Oh, I'm just seeing things. I'm just seeing things. Why do they re-sprite like... I don't know. Oh, oh, hello. Oh, that did a lot of damage. Alright, Wyvern. We're bringing you down. There we go, baby. Some air fragments too. Oh, jeez. That was a little bit laggy. All right, one more. <laughs> you can see the little bird teaching after us. Bird. Birdy gird. What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? It is a gird. What? That pet increases your alchemic damage? By 20%? And, well, that, that's a discovery... I have made. Interesting. Yeah, we should also probably get new armor soon, too. I think we can do these bosses without the um, new armor, though. So, yeah. That's good, at least. I'm pretty sure this has less capability than the... um. Hold on. How much does this do? 30. Okay, so it has better DPS, I guess. Or it might have better DPS. Even though this only shoots out 3 and the other one shoots out 5. Oh, hello! There we go. All right. I think there's very little chance of us not getting what we need. There we go. Yup, we got all we need, baby. What kind of tremor wings can we make? Boom. All right, all right, all right. So, we can make the chaos wings. Uh, No, not now. That's a post-pixie queen. The uh, frosted wings with a bit of a uh, uh, spriting bug. Flesh wings we can make. Uh, I don't know if we can make Bagbonium wings. Party over. Nope. Uh, red feather wings. I don't know how to get a red feather. Shadow wings. But we could get either vulture wings or flesh wings. The wings of skin and teeth. Ew. I, I mean, I'm going to take that. It does sound pretty cool. So let's just get that. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we shall make our flesh wings. I'm sorry, Torn Wings. You have served us for good. I mean, you have served us well over this long time. But I shall retire you for now. Still can't believe Tremor of all mods has that. Jeez. Alright, that was pretty quick. So now we can go get ready for our twins fight. Oh thank goodness. Wrath of the Wraiths. Unintentional weapon get? <laughs> nice. I was not expecting that. Boom, we replaced all our stuff. Wrath of Wraith. Oh, that actually looks really good for the twins. Oh my god. That was totally random. Definitely not planned. Nothing. LOL. 360. I can't believe we made this and we're like, this is so good. Gets a better weapon immediately. Like, this is really good. Oh my god. I can tell. Alright, everyone. Here we are at the arena. Or almost there, I mean. Yep, now we are. And let's just... Buff up and get on this twins fight. Hell yeah. Now, this should be a pretty good weapon for this, honestly. 
Let's see. Hey, it's not doing nice damage. Yeah, nice. I was right. Along with these, um, this, uh, infernal shield doing some damage as well. Nice. All right. This should be the fight in the back. Uh, you know, people have a lot of problems with the twins. I normally don't. I think the worst of mine is Skeletron Prime. And it's not even because it's hard. It's because I'm just dumb and I run into it so much. But these ones, I don't run to it in as much just because, um, I don't know. I just don't. All right, all right, all right. We're going good so far. About a quarter of the way done for each. We should probably focus on one and then um, get it dead and then focus on the other. Although that might be a little bit hard with the circumstances we have right now. Alright. This guy should be turning soon. Oh yeah, he should be turning real soon. Yep, he's just turned. Alright, second phase for... um. Spasmatism. I never remember. I should remember to spaz is the one that goes fast. Because, you know, spaz out. Spasm. I think that's the official word for it. Alright, alright, alright. Going good so far. If we're lucky, we can get the destroyer done tonight as well. Like, if we get it done before uh, midnight, I think. Although, I, I'm not counting on it. Alright, alright. I like to usually have a long time for the destroyer, so, um, we'll probably not do him yet. Alright, he's down to 2,000 health. Nice. We got, um, Spasmatism in the bag, as always. Spasmatism, it was nice knowing you all. Oh, Retinizer just changes as soon as his brother dies. Oh, oh, geez. Don't get hit by that laser. Hey, Master of Dodginess, come back out. I must dodge the retinizer laser spam. Alright, alright. I mean, on the 3DS edition, you could just um, cheese this fight by um, despawning one of the bosses by going farther away since the hardware for the 3DS is not as um, sophisticated as every other platform. So, that's a nice little tip in case you're struggling with that. <laughs> Which not many people are because not many people play the 3DS version. Thankfully, I have and I've beat it. Which is pretty pog, actually. Not gonna lie. That's like, I think that's one of the things you have to be to be a master Terrarian, or a very experienced one. Play and beat 3DS Terraria. I'm pretty sure Pedguin has, at least. Alright, boom! Twins defeated, y'all. Alright, yeah, no, we're gonna wait another night to do the, um, the Destroyer, just because I don't want to run out of time. Alright, Twins dead! Let's see what we got for them in 3, 2, 1, boom! Sam... It's the Mecha Sprayer, boys. The Mecha Sprayer. Bye-bye. Let's go. Let's go. Mecha Sprayer. Sprays out chemical clouds. It's actually very, very nice, bro. Not gonna lie. I was wondering when I'd get this. I guess now is the answer. Oh, what the heck? How much damage does this do? 58. Okay. And combines it. Nice. I appreciate. I appreciate. All right. The Mecha Sprayer, everyone. Interesting. Interesting drop. I was wondering when we'd get this or how'd we get it. And as always, we get the Souls of Sight, the Mechanical Wheel Piece, and the Hollowed Bars. I think we'll use this on the Destroyer, and we'll just actually shred it. I was wondering if we, what we're going to use, because it could have been a long time. Nice. Oh. Yes! Our time has come! Sacred Cross shall be crafted in the next episode. I don't really feel like crafting anymore this episode. It took a lot out of me. So much to do. So now I think we're just going to go chill and wait out until um, the day, or the, the next night, to do the Destroyer. Alright everyone, we're back once again. Jeez, this is going to take forever to do all three. And we're here to do the, not Mechanical Brain yet, the uh, Destroyer. So let's just buff up, start the fight. And let's see if this cheesing method works. Oh, it just might. I mean, Destroyer's pretty tanky too, so got to remember that. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, okay. We're getting a little bit wrecked, though, too. All right, all right. Interesting, interesting. A little bit harder than the Attic Cthulhu, I'll be honest. Are the twins? Ah, that's only because, um, you know, reasons. Reasons. Oh, jeez. Okay, time to switch back. All right, okay. Alchemy, come in handy. Baby. Let's go. Let's go. Ha 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 Nice try, Destroyer. My flasks are just too good for you. I'll just title the video. Alchemist overpowered? Oh, 
I'm gonna get so many negative reviews. <laughs> I think I have eaten my words as the expression goes. Let's just stay a little bit farther away now. Okay, okay, okay. Stay a little bit farther away from these probes. Listen, once we heal, we can go back in with the um sprayer. Okay, okay. We're cutting it really close. We are cutting it really close with this one. Oh, jeez. Okay, 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 okay. I will never use their nurse. I will not stoop down to that level. I shall never back down. I'm talking like I'm in some freaking anime character. Jeez. But do protagonists always win? Yes, they do. Lie? I don't know. Goodbye, Destroyer. It was nice knowing you. <laughs> for the time you were here. Ah, oh, thank you for the life, Destroyer. You are so kind today. Let's finish him off with the, um, Venom Flasks. Alright, Destroyer. <laughs> okay, you know, that was a little bit anti-dramatic. Anti-climatic, I mean. There we go, boys! Destroyer done! Yeah, no, I'm gonna wait another- Oh, wait, I don't even have the materials for the brain. Oh, well. boom, 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 boom. That was really slow. Alright, everyone! Time to open up the bag in three, two, one. Boom! Souls of Mike, the Destroyer Mask, and the Mechanical Wagon Piece, baby. Let's go. Alright, let's not do that. Alright. Mike, can we make cross guard face havers? That's what I saw Python use these. Although they don't look that good. I mean, they're kind of like the Glork, but um, a bit better, whatever. Ooh, a true Death Sickle looks sick. I'm not even joking. Alchemist is. Listen, Alchemist. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's, it's actually pretty good right now. With all the sprayers and the freaking flask. Oh my god. Here we have, we have these hallowed bars. They didn't look completely... Well, we could do this. Big bottled spirit. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. That's not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Who knows? Maybe one day I'll stream a, um, Alchemist series. That could be fun, honestly. Like, what I heard, Alchemist was bad. It's actually not too bad once you have the game fixed. And a few other things added, too. Ooh, the Sanctifier. Right, right, right. Where do we craft that? The Sanctifier. We could make, and then this is the um alternate, or the combination of the Bloodshed, the true versions, to get the um creator. Let's see. Increases alchemic and throne damage by 15%. We could actually use that right now. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, 28 alchemic damage? There's no way this does 28. Wait, am I looking at the wrong thing? No, I'm looking at the right thing. 28 alchemic damage. Oh, maybe that does do 28 alchemic damage. But, 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 if we have the Sanctifier on. Oh, not only are we getting that. 28 to 32. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Do we lose anything? Actually, yes. I kind of do want to use this, so sorry. I will make sure to use you later. All right, guys. So, um, I'm back. Uh, yeah. Uh,. Unfortunately, motherboard is not possible at this moment. And, you know, you might have been expecting this if you know Tremor. Motherboard is way too overpowered for the point that it is. Like, I'd say the most overpoweredness part of it is its first stage where it can summon drones, making it invincible. And, like, like, you know, very, very constantly. Almost too constantly. And has a laser that homes in that's... The wiki says it's unable to be dodged without a rod of discord. I'm not gonna deal with that. Honestly, like, listen, we'll do it, let's say, we'll do a post-Plantera, since the wiki says it's harder than Plantera herself, literally, that's the word, go look it up. We're gonna do it then. But for now, yeah, we, today, we got done the Twins and the Destroyer, and Motherboard, we'll do one over day. It literally says Destroyer, um, also, like, right here, so it's really more of a counterpart. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, make sure to subscribe, like, and share with a friend. My name is Just a Joe, and I'll see you in the next episode of Tremor Remastered. Bye-bye. Pixie Queen. Hello, Pixie Queen. Long time no...